Today we're going to dive Day Island in Tacoma, Washington. Both of us are taking video. We aren't there more than one minute when we see the first wolf eel. Most of the time divers see wolf fields in their dens, but at Day Island it's very common for them to come out and greet divers, sometimes interacting with them. A female wolf eel comes up and bumps me on the side. I'm not sure exactly what she wanted. Then she goes over to the male. They have strong jaws, spike-type front teeth, and huge flat molars in back for crushing snails, clams, even crabs. A wolf eel can take a sea urchin in its mouth and just chomp. Ooh. This wolf eel immediately comes to the front of the camera and tries to bite the lens. Another one came up behind me and tried to bite the video lights. Doesn't she look like a wolf? Well, she's not really an eel either. Actually, they should be called a wolf fish, but we call them wolf eels. The largest recorded wolf eel so far is eight feet long. Most of these were four to six feet. They look menacing because they open and close their mouth as they forced water past their gills. But as you can see, they're really quite friendly. It seems there were wolf fields all over the place. This is a very unusual day, even for Day Island. I haven't heard of a wolf eel biting a diver, at least not yet, here at Day Island. Divers are not one of their favorite foods, but just make sure that the eel you want to pet has read the same book.